Hello, I'm Sophia Gerard, and I'm a government relations intern with MTA Visions, a global corporate social responsibility and government relations firm based in Washington, DC. I'm from Westport, Connecticut, and I'm currently an international relations student at the University of St. Andrews in Scotland. I aspire to work with a government or foreign policy agency advising on global conflict resolution. I chose MTA Visions for my summer professional experience because of the firm's global outlook, amplifying impact both locally and internationally. This benefits my studies as an international relations student who researches how local politics can inform policy in the larger international system. MTA Visions also emphasizes accountability to a firm's stakeholders, which I believe is an important aspect of fostering diversity and inclusion in policy decisions. Overall, I believe MTA Visions can help apply my academic research on global conflict resolution into a real world context. My goals for the summer as an intern with MTA Visions are to develop my research skills on policy issues to gain confidence advising on them, to learn the different strategies used in consulting by grasping the global consulting life cycle, and to gain valuable experience in a corporate setting. As an intern with MTA Visions, I'm committed to being independent, innovative, flexible, positive, and high performing. I believe I'm independent as I moved to a new country for college where I had to adapt to being far away from my family and adjusting to a new culture. I plan to excel at being independent as a government relations intern by using the remote position to develop as a self-starter and work on projects without explicit guidance. As the Charities and Outreach Officer, I was innovative by coming up with fun activities to help build a relationship between my team and the surrounding community. I plan to be innovative as a government relations intern by presenting my policy research in diverse and engaging ways. Furthermore, I've demonstrated flexibility through remote learning during the pandemic, adjusting to online Zoom discussions. I plan to excel at flexibility as a government relations intern by adapting to a fast-paced remote work environment and assisting in any tasks required. I demonstrated positivity by experiencing two lockdowns in Scotland while remaining focused on my academic work and showing up with a good attitude. I plan to be positive as a government relations intern by offering constructive policy solutions rather than only identifying policy problems. Finally, I achieved high performance as an intern for a mayoral candidate by juggling multiple tasks, including editing policy proposals and creating content for all social media sites. I plan to be high performing as an intern by being productive, delving into my research projects and maximizing the opportunities provided. If I could write a bill into law, I would write a law that holds American multinational corporations environmentally and socially responsible. The title of my bill would be the Multinational Corporation Regulatory Act. I believe this bill is important because there is insufficient legislation restricting the activities of US-based multinational corporations. The current legislation outlined in the North American Trade Agreement requires voluntary codes of conduct and is ineffective at regulating multinational company activity. Through the passage of my bill, there will be greater protection for workers' rights abroad and more restrictions on ecological degradation. If I could change a law, I would change provisions from the Gun Control Act of 1968, which regulates the transfer of firearms and sets age restrictions for purchasing them. I would change this law by raising the age limit for purchasing rifles from licensed firearms dealers from age 18 to 25 and the handgun age limit from 21 to 25. As most human brains do not develop until 25, I believe raising the age limit could prevent dangerous gun activity. My goal in changing this law would be to restrict access to guns to reduce the circulation of weapons amongst younger generations. In March, President Biden signed into law the American Rescue Plan to help stimulate the economy in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. While this act does provide some economic relief and alleviates underinsurance, it does not address the disproportionate impact of health security on racial minorities and low-income families. The pandemic exacerbates health disparities due to discrimination and accessibility to healthcare. My recommendation would be for Congress to ratify Biden's executive order of ensuring an equitable pandemic response and recovery and to work closely with the COVID-19 Health Equity Task Force to strategize ways to limit bias in healthcare facilities. The top three issues that I'm interested in exploring during my internship are gender-based violence and women's movements, immigration policy and its effect on minority populations, and environmental justice with the accountability of transnational corporations. 
MTA Visions is a global firm whose work spans across sectors and geography. As a result, I look forward to specializing in the following seven countries. The United States, East Timor, China, the Democratic Republic of Congo, Guatemala, Palestine, Denmark, Jamaica, and Fiji. I selected East Timor to study the importance of analyzing gender-based violence in peacebuilding contexts, Colombia for its grassroots movement on gender equality and politics, and Denmark for its efficient greenhouse gas emission policies to combat climate change. I look forward to the unique opportunity to build my cultural competency with MTA Visions. During my MTA Visions internship experience, I will have the unique opportunity to engage in the global consulting life cycle. If I could select a client and a service to provide, it would be the Atlantic Council consulting on U.S. energy policy to help fulfill the U.S.'s obligations in the Paris Climate Agreement. As the Atlantic Council notes, the United States has become dominant in global energy, which means that it is responsible for leading the research on renewable energy sources. As I am interested in environmental justice, this is an issue I would like to provide expertise on. As an MTA Visions 2021 Summer Government Relations Intern, I look forward to learning how to champion profit with purpose, amplify impact both locally and globally, and to protect the clean interests in sovereign states at all levels of the U.S. government.